Hey guys, how's it going? It is I, B, or you guys can call me by my real name, Eugene. Doesn't matter, I don't really care. You guys can call me Bob or Joe or freaking whatever you want to freaking call me. Doesn't freaking matter to me, okay? But we're here, boys, back in Arkesia. Completely vibed out, by the way, okay? Let me tell you guys this, all right? And this is 100% facts, all right? The vibes here in Arkesia, just too real, guys. They're just so real, so prevalent, and I can just feel the vibes all over my face and my body. And it's great, guys, let me tell you. Let me tell you that, it's, it's wonderful. But anyways, guys, so let's do a little recap of what we did in the last video. So in the last video, we left the uh, Lutera Castle or something like that, and we ended up going to the Flowering Orchard to help out the citizens over here, who are also a part of the Lutera Kingdom. And it looks as if they are being harassed or being uh, controlled. They're kind of being like controlled, kind of. The bad guys who are called the heretics are, you know, trying to like influence and like scare the citizens here at the flowering orchard and we are here to put an end to that bullshit because i can't freaking because we can't ex we don't we won't accept that here all right this is tyrain's place not sherrod's place anymore and i believe the heretics are in cahoots with the remaining members who are still alive of sherrod's army it's either that or with the demons well i guess it, it could be both because sherrod was you know uh, colluding with the demon, so it could be both, but yeah, so we did a bunch of quests, uh, helping out the people here, getting them food, getting them water, stopping the hair or killing some heretics, you know, to stop them from harassing the citizens of the Flowering Orchard, and now we're just here uh, doing more quests to, uh, you know, help the villagers, so um, yeah, guys, we're uh, right where we, we left off in the last video, and um, yeah, it's just gonna be a very fun time, guys. I am enjoying Lost Ark a lot, guys. Um, I don't care what anyone says. I don't care if, you know, like, I hear some freaking complaining freaking Andes on the freaking internet going like, Oh, it's so pay to win once you hit max level. I don't freaking give a shit, alright? I'm having fun. That's all that matters. But yes, guys. We are here back at the Flowering Orchard. And we got some quests here. We got some dings. Let's just get right into the video, guys. Let's get down to business. Alright, we got some dings, we got some dings, so you already know, your boy loves the dings, alright, and if you guys don't know, I call these dings, the little exclamation points, I called them in WoW, I called the dem um, dings in WoW, and I call them dings here, I call them dings everywhere, whatever, but um, yeah guys, so we already have a quest that we have to do as part of the main quest, we have to help, help evacuate the villagers against the, oh what the heck, oh, I don't think I meant to press that button, we gotta help evacuate the villagers against the heretics, because they're freaking... Not only are they heretics, but they're freaking lunatics, alright? And they're freaking harassing and, you know, bothering these guys. And we just gotta freaking... We gotta freaking end that shit, because... Come on, man. Like, we're just all trying to live peacefully here. And we got these fucking assholes over here trying to freaking keep causing havoc. Even though we freaking killed freaking, uh, Sherrod. It looks like they're just still not done harassing the people. And, you know, as the chosen one... We gotta fulfill our duty and save these people, alright? Before we do that, okay? More before, as I know. So many before we do that, all that stuff. We gotta collect our little login event, so... I think I forgot to maybe accept this from... Yesterday's login event, but we got some honing shard selection chest. I'm just gonna take it because, you know... I love me some free goodies. Alright, so it looks like we got that. And we gotta get our login event reward. I do love that. And what do we have here? Oh, this is kind of some booty cheeks. This is just for like professions. If you run out of energy to do professions, you use it to gain the energy back. Which I guess is okay, but I mean this this bar right here, it um 30 work energy restored per 10 minutes. Okay, so it's, it's kind of a bit slow, but I don't really do it too much. Alright, but oh let me let me look at these little red things. We've got some red things that we gotta do. So okay, all of roster characters, strength, dexterity, intelligence. Plus five. Definitely taking that. Some good stuff. Card catalog. And oh my god, this page... This page confuses me, man. Because I don't know what these things do. 
So these things don't even work because I need to it, it, I need to have two to complete the set bonus. So these kind of don't even really work. But we got some new cards, which is pretty cool. I like having the cards. I just don't know really how to really properly use these guys. You know, I'm a big fat noob when it comes to this game. Oh, there's a guide here that tells you how to use them. But you know what? It's going to be so boring to watch. I don't want to put you guys through that. Let's get our little Leap Essence guy. Um, and I think, do we have anything else we need to look at? I don't think we need, I don't think we have anything else we need to look at. Yeah, I think that's about it. Yeah, just collectibles, whatever, Mokoko seeds, blah blah blah, all that good stuff. Okay guys, now! Now we start the video, boys. Alright, so let's go ahead and talk to Neb here. It looks like she's a little bit sad. We can see her crying, so definitely gotta help her out. So what's up, baby girl? Oh, it's my fault. I should have never left my sister by herself at home. Oh dear knight, you said you're from the capital, right? You're the king's knight, aren't you? Please, please help me. Please, I'll do anything that I can. Whoa, whoa, so take it easy there, Neb. All right, I'm, I'm all right. You don't need to go on and begging. Um, you know, I'll gladly help you. No, no problem. All right, so says, listen to Neb's request. I have to find my sister Rhea. If she hears my voice, she'll come running to me. Even if it's dangerous, I don't have a choice. She might be trapped under the debris. Could you please search the rubble? Oh, okay, that is not good. We gotta definitely do that. Alright, well, okay, before we do that, though, let's go ahead and talk to Weasel here. This little weasel. Oh, I barely got out alive. My caravan was on the way to Lutera Castle, and we decided to make a brief stop at this village. How did it come to this? How terrible. Oh dear. Oh my caravan. Oh dear. What? Freaking, just freaking uh, collect yourself, man, and freaking let me know what's going on, because you're just freaking spe spewing out freaking nonsense right now. Ask what trade company people look like. What? Huh? What are you talking about? I'm looking for my stuff, not people. Man, we gotta get this man's stuff. Just freaking get the stuff yourself, you freaking... I'm sick and tired of all these lazy bums making me do all the freaking things. The shenanigans they have to they, that they have to do, you know? Freaking lazy bozos. But alright guys, I got, as per usual, got my coffee, I got my vape, and I'm ready to game. Alright? I'm ready to get down with these heretics. Oh, what's this? <gasps> it says help. What the heck? This better not be- Rhea better be okay under here. Oh, what the- what the- Oh, okay. Oh, well that's good. We saved- we helped save that guy. Where's he going? You gonna go back to the village? Or are you just gonna vi- oh, oh, he's gonna just disappear. Alright. I- oh my god, and look at the village, man. It, uh, got burned down. Wow. Yeah, these heretics are fucking crazy, man. Oh, and there's the freaking culprit right here. Weird village woman. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, she looking crazy. We definitely gotta freaking give her the freaking one-two punch right here. We definitely gotta give her that freaking Taco Bell freaking special right there. All right, but here we go. Uh, looks like we have to help evacuate There's some of these villagers. There. There's still people in there. Uh-oh, that's not good. Who is this guy? Weird village man. All right, you want some too? You want some of this freaking uh? Two for one freaking McDonald's special. Four nuggets for freaking one dollar. I freaking give that to you easy any freaking day, man. Well, bam, boom. All right, nice. Oh. Still people in there. Oh, okay. I think I stole that from this guy. Whoops, my bad, my guy. Huh. Yeah. Wee. Oh, he helped me kill him. How nice. Neighborhood grandpa. What is you doing here, my guy? You gotta get out of here. Can't you tell the whole freaking city is getting freaking burned? And there's freaking crazy lunatics running around? You gotta get out of here, man. Oh, what the heck? I'm in Channel 1. I don't wanna be in Channel 1. It's probably the most populated... Probably the most populated server. Well, I guess I'm not lagging, so I guess it's fine. In the basement storage. Wait, what'd she say? I heard someone in the basement storage. Oh, what the heck? Okay, well that's a little bit of uh, that's a good bit of information there. Maybe that's where Rhea's at. Boom. 
Okay, guys, so we're level 34. OMG, guys, we're almost level 40. I'm so excited, guys. We're almost level 40. We're about 10 levels away from max level. Oh my god, guys. I am literally so horny right now. Alright, excuse my language. I'm sorry, guys, if there's any kids watching. Oh, it's the clown, guys. Oh, this guy looks pretty cool. Alright, let's just fight this guy, because, I mean, it'll be pretty cool to fight him, right? Boom! Oh, we got uh, something for our quest, actually. Find the merchandise stolen by the heretics and clowns. Okay, so we have to fight these clowns, actually. Oh, okay, so we got two uh, items. Nice. So it looks like we have, to just keep, we have to just keep farming these clown guys. Which, uh, is no biggie. You don't mind fighting me some clowns, especially if they're freaking evil. Alright. We don't like no evil clowns here. And we don't like these weird village guys. These guys are kind of weird. Oh! oh look at these freaking weirdos. Freaking trying to summon a demon or something like that. Not on my watch, you bastards! You can freaking eat it! Yeah, that's right. Get out of here. Alright. Oh no, look at... Ugh, look at this little guy in the cage, man. They are fucking things up, bro. What is wrong with these people, bro? Oh, okay, what is this? Oh, oh, oh. Uh, oh, okay. Wait. I think we found Rhea, maybe. Let's go talk to Rhea. I think she's over here in this the north side of the uh, area. Oh, here we go. Yep, in the basement. Who is this? Oh, it's a player. Oh, wow. This guy's outfit looks cool. Let's look at his outfit. Oh, wow. I like this guy's outfit. Wow, this guy looks really cool. Oh, hopefully we get to uh, look like this guy soon. Alright, let's talk to Bianca here. What? Weasel? That wretched thief. All the stuff you brought back originally belonged to me. What kind of merchant would leave their stuff behind? That can never happen. Think about it. I never ran away, so all of that still belongs to me. You are about to steal my belongings? Well, I'll let it slide if you just leave them all here. How am I going to get them out of here? Uh, I'll figure that out, so just give them back to me. Isn't it easier to just hand them over to me than head all the way back to Weasel? Man, I guess. I don't even know if I could trust you. Well, Weasel did ask first. Double. I'll pay you double. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about, right? Like, I mean, how do I, how can I trust you, you know? Ooh, I'm working up a sweat. A true merchant never gives up. Just you wait and see. I'll get through this. Stronger than ever. Um, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, okay, looks like we finished that guy. Alright, cool beans, cool beans. Alright, so let's go, uh, we gotta go back to where we originally were, towards, like, the southern area of this place, and, uh, we gotta go talk to Armin, and, uh, talk to Tim. Oh, Mokoku Seed! Oh, let me get this. Uh, okay, looks like these guys wanna freaking get down, though. Huh? You wanna freaking get down, you freaking lunatic heretics? Yeah, that's what I thought. You thought you didn't freaking realize you were fighting the freaking chosen one. Freaking idiots. Yeah, that's right. Get owned. Alright, very nice. Mokoko seed action. I like those. Okay, wait, where are we supposed to go? Oh, we're actually a bit far. Whoops. We actually went a little bit too far. Alright, so we have to go back here. Oh, okay. We still have to find Rhea, though, right? Where's Rhea? Or maybe we... I don't know, actually. Or right, whatever. Help, dear priest. There's Reyna, but not Rhea. Alright, let's talk to Tim first, because he's a side quest, so... It's probably going to be, uh... It's probably going to be a little less important. I thought I could hear Neb crying out. She probably came back to find Rhea. Uh, as unfortunate as it is, it's not just Neb's sister. We've all lost someone. All these ordinary yet special people of the village. Oh yeah, this is fucked up, guys. What the hell? What the hell, man? Why is there so much fucking destruction and death happening right now? I want to. I don't like this. When everything went crazy, we lost track of a lot of the folks. So many of us are unaccounted for. Where could they have all gone? Are they still trapped in the village? I just hope that they're still alive. The heretics attacked out of the blue. It was so sudden. I couldn't think about anyone else but myself. As for Reyna, we dragged her here and hit her. But her aunt, Sophia, wasn't so lucky. We can't find her. <laughs> Yikes. 
and poor Neb has lost all sense of reality. She claims her sister Rhea is in the village calling to her, but Rhea passed almost... Rhea passed away almost a decade ago. Oh my god, yo, this is so sad, bro. Bro, they gonna make me cry in this video game? What's up with this shit, man? This is some sad ass shit, bro. And we definitely gotta help uh, Neb. And my fiance, Milena. She went back to try and find more survivors, but I haven't heard from her in some time. I'm sorry, I can't stop thinking of her. Most of us were into that cult. We had no idea things would end up like this. Oh, you freaking idiot. What are you, what are you doing joining a cult? We thought that the evangelist would save us. We couldn't have been more wrong. Oh no, yeah, these, what's going on here? This is not good. Alright, Armin, we gotta do something, Over Armin. Here. We gotta help it the situation out. situation is worse than we thought. I know, right? Holy shit. The heretics have been moving the people somewhere else. It doesn't seem like brainwashing the villagers is their sole purpose. I rescued someone who was almost abducted by the heretics, but she's having trouble calming down. Oh, Rayla. Okay, Armin, are you gonna do something? You're just gonna freaking stand there like a freaking bot, like an AI. Let me go. What is this place? Is it safe? Yeah, it's safe. We got Armin and me here. Uh, I lost everything. My family, my friends, everything. My daughter, Sophia. Where could she be? All of this. It all happened, the sa it all happened since the day that sound started playing. That weird music box sound. Even the regular folks, they all fell for the heretic's lies, and now I don't know where they all went. They followed someone they called the Elder or something. Oh, the heretics carried around a list of their orders. There might be something written there. No. Huh? My... What are we doing? Find Reyna's aunt Sophia, destroy the music box of mayhem. Alright, let's freaking do it. Yeah, we gotta really help these guys out, because this place is freaking fucked up right now. Oh my god. Alright, uh, let's just fight these guys, because these guys are all doucheweeds. Just trying to freaking terrorize some, you know, regular-ass citizens, man. Like, come on, man. This is so fucked up, man. Ow. Oh, oh you want to freaking... Oh, you... Oh, you freaking! You don't know who you messing with, my guy. I'm the freaking chosen one. You freaking a a wipe. You freaking ass wipe. Yeah, that's right. I freaking better get down. Oh, what is this? Find Rainus Aunt Sophia. Oh God. It, we completed the quest. I guess maybe she passed away. Uh oh, that's not good. Destroy the music box of mayhem. All right, where's the music box? Oh, Mokoko seed. Where's the music box of mayhem? Maybe that person already killed it. We just probably have to wait for it to respawn. We probably have to wait for it to respawn. Oh, this is nice. Got a little dock area. I like this. Get a little nice view of the water. Alright, is the music box? Music box? Oh, here's the music box. Nice. Oh, what the heck is casting something? Oh, well, okay. We destroyed it anyways. Alright. Alright, okay. Let's just go ahead and deal with these crazies over here. Oh, yeah. Boom. Oh, yeah. You want to freaking keep terrorizing the village? These your freaking clowns. Not on my watch. Alright, so it looks like we didn't find uh, Neb's sister, Rhea. But maybe a clue as to where she might be. And it looks like we have to head down over here. Oh, we got another clue. The Blue's Clues. Oh, what the? Man, get your freaking lame ass out of here, my guy. Frick you. Yeah, that's right. Frick off. Frick off, Leahy. If you guys uh, know, if you guys watch Trailer Park Boys, that's where I, it's from. And if you guys do watch it, I love you guys immensely. Milena's Will. Tim, I'm still alive. My head, it swims. I can't think straight. I want to see your face one last time. Please, I want to see you. I miss you. Oh, our friends, the evangelists. They came back for me. I can hear them. They're going to save us. I can see now everything. Tim, come find me. We're here. Join us. 
Join us in death? Man, what the hell? Hell nah. Man, I'm gonna stay alive, man. Yo ass got caught, not me. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Alright, I'm just kidding, guys. That was fucked up. Rest in peace to Milena. Man, this is so bad. What's wrong with this area? I hate this area. It's like filled with so much death. I don't like it. Alright, so we killed the heretic leader. That's good. Uh, and then what is this? What? Uh, oh, wait, what? Uh, okay, we can just complete it. Oh, we got some gold! Hey there! Hey there, goldy guy. I like that. Alright, looks like we have a bridge, but we don't have the little animation to cross it, so we can't cross it. The only way we can get there is by doing a little wraparound skis. Oh, we got a ding down here, too. It's very nice. Oh, we're stuck on a- oh, we're stuck on a rock. Oh, is that a Mococo seed? Oh, no. He was just doing something. There's like this green thing that popped up around. I thought it was Mococo seed. Oh, right, well, okay. So, let's go ahead and, um... Go over here. I'm not sure where this is. Uh, circus encampment. And let's just hopefully try to, um, you know, drive these heretics out of, um... What is this place called again? The, uh, the flowering orchard? Yeah, we gotta, we gotta get these guys out of here, man. These guys are fucking away. crazy. Here's the villager who got away. Okay. Now right, let's get this triport here. Alright, so let's go talk to Observer Cyrun or Cyrun. Hello, my name is Cyrun, and I'm a romantic wanderer who goes wherever the wind takes me, observing this world's wonders. Currently, my biggest interest is in the, is the mysterious clowns that have shown up around here recently. Where do they come from? How do they live? Where will they go afterward? Such philosophical topics, don't you think? Uh, not really. I, I don't really give a fuck about them. They're evil, bro. Who gives a fuck? I always think about these questions. By the way, I've watched them for a while and observed quite a few suspicious things about them. Why did they show up here? There are a few things I need for more in-depth research. How would you like to join me? Man, this guy is freaking asking so many questions. I kind of don't want to join you, but I guess. Because I need some experience. I love me some XP. Alright. All right, let's go talk to Billy here. Billy the kid. What in the world is going on? Ah, uh, there's heretics going on. That's what's going on. When I came to my senses, I found myself walking somewhere with a bunch of other people. I pushed away the guy holding onto me and fled. It was all very frightening. I'm not sure what happened to the others. I think they went to the Black Rose Chapel. They say it's abandoned, but now there are lights inside and the sound of people praying. Hmm. Interesting. All right, let's go ahead and talk to my boy Armin. Those who were captured were sent to the Black Rose Chapel? Yes, sir. Goodness, we need to hurry. We need to figure out a way to get inside the church building. Okay. So we gotta go to Black Rose Chapel, uh, probably there's more heretics there, we gotta save some more of the villagers. Oh, we got some more clown guys here. Uh, oh, wait, uh, collect clown trumpet. Oh, okay, we have to kill these guys, actually. Oh, oh shit, I'm on the wrong sp uh, I thought I was on my handgun ability. Oh, we did it, okay. Oh, you know what, I'm just gonna go and turn the quest now, I guess. There's a quest down here, which I'm go I wanna go get. So we can go do that, guys. But let's go just turn in the quest. Very well, let's start with the next ex with an experiment with this trumpet. Now, the subject of this experiment will have to be you, Hello Bee. Of course, I put a simple spell on this trumpet here. Why don't you try bl uh, to blow on it right now? One, two, three. Um... Normally, I wouldn't do weird things like that, but I guess it's a video game. We turned into a clown, what the heck? Oh wow, this is cool. Hey, we're a clown, guys, look at us. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so cool. Dude, I want to stay like this forever, kind of. <laughs> wait, 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 let's see if we can go to the enemies and let's see if they'll see us as hostile or not since we are a clown. <gasps> They're actually non-hostile. Wow, interesting. Cool, that's a little cool mechanic there. So we can blend in with these guys. <laughs> this is this is actually really funny. This is cute. I like this. Oh, well, not really cute. Well, it is cute, but... 
I mean, I don't like these evil guys. I don't like being the evil guy. I like being the good guy, you know. Alright, well, okay, let's go back and talk to uh, Cyrus. Or, yeah, Cyrun. Very simple. You've turned into a fabulous clown. Now, Hello B, as the observer in the experiment, I'd like you to infiltrate their society. Please go see, hear, taste, and feel everything as best as you can. If your transformation wears off, use the clown trumpet to transform again. Okay. We'll be in trouble if they catch the wind of this. If your transformation wears off, use the clown trumpet again. Okay. Alright, so what do we gotta do? What do we have to do? We have to go... Okay, we have to go down here. We have to infiltrate their society. Learn about all the ins and outs, ins and outs of how they work. Oh, look at this. This is pretty cool. Oh, I like this. Oh, okay, looks like we got to finish the quest here. Alright, let's do it. Save our sister from a world of despair. Oh my god, what are they doing? Oh my god! <gasps> they changed Sophia into a clown! No! What are you doing? Oh my god, bro. What the hell is wrong with these guys, bro? Hell no, nah, we gotta fucking murder these fools. We have to, yeah, we're definitely, we're definitely gonna own these guys. Okay, um, I guess, uh, let's press F5, what is this? Okay, there's nothing. Alright, we have to keep infiltrating, I guess. Dude, I just wanna, I just wanna, um, cancel, oh, we can't even, even, we can't even go in here, it's being blocked. I wanna cancel this just so we can freaking whoop their ass. Alright, we'll just stick with the disguise for now. We won't uh, get rid of our disguise, you know. Just yet. Alright, well, let's look at this cl uh, clown bulletin board. Oh, that's a bug right there. I was behind it and now we're in front of it. It's fine, though. Main event announcement. The show of your life. Simply incredible. Elation and pleasures galore. Welcome to the circus. Introducing today's star. This beautiful sacrifice was once a bride-to-be with her wedding just around the corner. How will her rage be transformed? Defeat newborn Malin. Uh, wait, we have to kill a baby? Um, I don't know how I feel about that, but it's a freaking demon, baby! Fuck it, man, we're a freaking slay that motherfucker. Yo, this is so fucked up, guys. What are these guys doing to these people? These guys are fucking fucked. Oh. Oh, this guy's already killing him. Oh, man. Alright, yeah, I'm gonna switch channels because, uh, oh wow, there's only two channels right now. Wow. Oh, there we go. Alright, let's, uh, let's go fuck these freaking losers up. Yeah, frick you! Uh, dear gods, may you stay your hands, for with great agony I have paid for my sin of being born. I shall do with my life as I please, henceforth. The young sapling that once looked toward you for the false promise of salvation from endless from this endless misery has now perished. Uh, below its withered roots, a new seed of avarice and madness has begun to sprout. Allow it to groom and bloom its repulsive buds at, as it was born to be. No longer will life inflict any more suffering upon us. Dear Tim, pray when you want to die. Um, uh, that is kind of weird. Uh, hold on, let me turn back into the clown. Alright, there we go. Nice. Uh, okay, yeah, that was kind of weird. Um, I guess that was good that we killed him. Notice of delay in main event. Unfortunately, our bride is now unable to perform due to an unfortunate accident. We offer our sincerest apologies to our audience members who waited eagerly for the show. We'll keep you posted on the new show dates. Hell no, you won't. I'm gonna freaking destroy this place. Fuck that shit. Alright, so it says we have to go visit the demon shop while disguised, and it looks like it's down here. Alright, so let's go do that, guys. Maybe there's a Mococo seed here. Maybe, maybe. No, it looks like there isn't. Alright, so let's just keep on going. So it looks like all these clowns are actually villagers from 
the flowering orchard, which is pretty sad. Oh wow, look at this guy. He's a big boy. And a bunch of other clowns. Oh, these guys will probably be pretty cool to fight, but we're just gonna we're not gonna fight them just yet. We wanna maintain our secrecy. Yeah, what's so funny, man, huh? I don't know if I can get to work eventually, alright? Who's this guy? Nafta. Hee hee hee, who are you? What brings you this far? You want some food? Huh. Sure, I can get uh, some for you. For a price, of course. This is great. I need some skills dropped from Goroa. Get me a few of them and I'll share my food with you. Try not to get yourself beat up, buddy. I'll give you two minutes, then I'm eating this all myself. Huh? Uh, okay, so we have to fight these Goroas in uh, under two minutes. Alright, well, you know what? I'm gonna. F oh, actually, no, we don't. We can just do this. There is a pungent smell. Alright, so we have to just collect a bunch of these things that were on the ground. We only have a minute and 30 seconds left, uh, so we need to kind of hurry. Where's that smell coming from? Oh, you actually said something besides hee hee hee. Alright, so there's two out of three. Hopefully, oh, we got another one right here. Perfect, perfect. <laughs> I smell something funny. Mm. Oh, it's not me. Don't, don't worry about me. Just, uh... Keep on with your clown activities, alright? You didn't see anything. Wow, tee hee hee, wow, you came back alive. How unusual. Usually when something comes too close, Gorora smashes it in the head. Anyway, good job, I really needed these. Why would you be so curious about our food coming all the way over here? Tee hee, what? You think I don't know what you really are? If I yell out right now, you're dead meat. But I absolutely love crazy people, huh? As a reward, I'll give you the lunch I brought for myself today. I hope it suits your palate. Hee <laughs> hee. Oh, hello. Hold on. Let's just buy these. So we get a, a laugh emote. Do we already have the laugh emote? Hold on, let me see if we already have the laugh emote. Okay, it looks like we don't have the... Oh, we don't have the laugh emote. Okay, let's buy it, guys. Let's buy it. And Book of Demons, I'm just gonna buy it because, I don't know, it's, why not, right? Wait, hold on, let me look at this. What is this, luxury goods? Oh, okay, that, that's it. Alright, uh, looks like we're done here. We could kind of just, um, we could remove our disguise and just start owning these guys, which I kind of want to do. So, um, but I feel like these guys might be a little bit strong. Uh, you know what, I might just, uh, you know what, fuck it. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna do it. Screw it. Let's just freaking... Let's just take this uh, a little bit uh, easy, because it looks like there's a lot of enemies, and probably don't want to deal with all of these guys at once. They might be a little bit tough. <laughs> I smell something funny. Oh, you smell something funny? It's probably you, you freaking fat poop. Alright, well, cancel our disguise, and I'm just gonna freaking... I'm just gonna horse you on out of here. Wahee! Alright, let's just get out of here. Try to get out of here ASAP, Rocky. Because these guys are freaking crazy, man. Oh, but that was kind of cool, guys. I like the whole little circus vibe thing. That was pretty cool. Unfortunately, these guys are evil AF. But it was pretty cool. <laughs> Excuse me. Alright, let's go ahead and talk to the Observer Cyrun. So this is what those demons feed on. Um, yes. Now, why don't you open it yourself? Uh, oh, okay, the lunatic lunch. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's do that. The box releases an ear-piercing piercing scream. Stun. What the heck? What happened? Despair, cries, fear, screams. So these are the things they want from humans, just as I suspected. They feed on our misery, it seems. Thank you. Because of your help, Hello Bee, I was able to complete this very important research. No problem, my guy. I mean, it would have been better if you freaking joined me on your little freaking adventure, but I mean, you're a freaking pansy. You didn't want to freaking do that. Freaking making me go alone. Alright, okay. So actually, it looks like we're uh, finished here at the uh, Flowering Orchard, guys. Pretty good stuff here. I'm gonna go check out this area that we didn't explore though, because there's maybe like something good here. Maybe there's a mococo seed or something. 
So let's keep our eyes peeled. What is this? Huh? Oh yeah, sure. Uh, so my faith has grown deeper. Make today different from yesterday and tomorrow from today. Eventually my life will be filled with nothing but pleasure, the elder said. I felt him getting close to me and when I embraced him, I saw new things. In the dark, he laughs. One person follows him, two people follow him, three people follow him, four people follow him. Oh my god, it keeps going on. Five people follow him, blah 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 blah, all the way up to fucking 13 people. Everyone follows him. Our flesh and blood will become one. In the end, only he will be the one left laughing. Man, what the hell is up with these creepy motherfuckers here, bro? They gotta fucking chill out, bro. But I, well, I guess it's good that we came here, guys, because we got a little questy poo. I do love me some questy poos. He 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 he. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Oh, what the fuck? He turned into a clown. Our frick you. Yeah, that's right, freaking. Get down, you freaking weirdo. Right, let's go ahead and uh, unveil this guy's disguise and give him the freaking beat down. Yeah, that's right, sucker. All right, so find Neb's sister, Rhea. Oh my god, Rhea's still alive. What? Yo, let's go. You're not Neb, but close enough. Oh, what the fuck? She turned into a clown. Oh no. Dude. No, that's not good. That is not good. So Rhea got turned into a clown. Uh-oh. That is not good, guys. All right, anything over here? Maybe any collectibles? Mo Coco seeds, potentially. All right, looks like none here. All right, well, let's check out this area, though. I want to check out. Oh, what, what is this? I think I saw something here. Right? Oh my God! Well, hold on. Oh, oh shit! Hold on! Hold on! Hold on! Hiya! Boom! I thought I saw something I could click, but I. I guess I was maybe wrong. I think it was maybe this guy, maybe? I, I don't know. Whatever. Let's check this out, though. I want to check out this little, uh, little, um, little jump piece here. Little, uh, in the little other, this little secret zone. Alright, so we got some, uh, vine climbing action. Let's do some Tarzan flow. I dig that. We found some items from those guys. Maybe they're a little bit stronger. Oh, no, they're not. They're a little bit weaker. Let's go ahead and dismantle these. Oh! Oh, a vista! Let's get a nice little view of the area, guys, shall we? Alright. I mean, I guess this would be a nice view if these fucking, fucking heretic lunatic motherfuckers weren't destroying this place. Look at this place, man. This place looks so... So miserable. Oh, no. Oh, man, guys. It makes me sad. Makes me sad looking at all the destruction of this place. It's not good, guys. Alright, well, let's take a little slidey action. Whee! Alright. Alright, so we're good to go here. It looks like, the, looks like that was all that was there, I think. Unless I missed the Mokoko Sea, which, you know, that could potentially uh, have happened. Uh, but let's go ahead and talk to Neb again. Let her know about her sister. Uh, fortunately, uh, she got turned into a clown. Because these freaking assholes are just like... Man, I don't even know what they're doing, man. They're on demon time, bro. That's what they're doing. Rhea, I'm right here. Sweet Rhea. And I ain't Rhea. But I'll let you know what happened to Rhea. Sir Knight. Rhea isn't out there. I couldn't bring Rhea with me. I'll, I'll do the second one. What do you... Oh, no. Something happened to my sister, Rhea, didn't it? Ah, uh, please, Sir Knight. Nothing bad happened to her, did it? Please say it didn't. You might want to sit down. Whatever that thing was, I killed it. Uh, you might want to sit down. Are you saying you... You... Oh! Sorry, my voice acting is terrible, guys. I know, I'm not a freaking voice actor. I'm trying my freaking best, though, alright? How? How could you? What? Man, what the hell? Freaking... Back off, you freaking weird village lady. Frick off, man. I'm trying to freaking let Neb know what's going down. Man, we gotta freaking go through this whole freaking thing again. It was a monster, not Rhea. Snap out of it. Demons are warping your mind. Uh, I'll do the snap out of it thing, because it looks like she is just very, very mentally distressed. So, you know, it's good to just be like, 
Lay it down hard. Be like, hey man, you gotta freaking snap out of it. So I'm gonna do that. Liar, you lie, you lie, you lie. Rhea's alive. She's come back to us. That horrible disease didn't. Oh gods, you're right. You're right. You must think I'm some fool, hello B. But it all felt- Man, what the f Are you fucking kidding me, bro? Get the fuck off, bro. Fucking annoying ass. What the hell? But it all felt so real. Oh, Rhea. Alright, well. That was a pretty sad quest to do, guys. But, alright, well. I mean, hopefully we did everything we could to help out the villagers here. But it looks like, you know, it's not looking so hot for these guys. I wish we could have done more. But it looks like, I mean, we weren't even really able to prevent these things from happening because, I mean, we, it looks like we came a little bit too late. But okay, guys. So, we are approaching the new zone. Let's go ahead and go inside uh, the Black Rose Chapel. We have to talk to someone named Saria. Oh, and here's the engravings things. I don't really know how these work. So I'm just gonna... I don't know, I'll probably eventually figure out later. Oh, we got a little camera angle switch up. This is pretty cool. Oh, this, I thought that was NPC. All right, so let's look at the new area, guys. So this is the Black Rose Chapel. Oh, and nice, guys. We got ourselves a dungeon. The Black Rose Basement. I do love me some dungeones. Alright, I'm gonna do a couple of quests here and probably end the video because we're not at the hour mark just yet. I like to make my videos at least like an hour long-ish, about. I feel like that's a good time, you know, a good amount of time. You get a good- you get to see a, a good amount of me every day, you know? Alright, uh, looks like there's just some little beetle guys, beetle juice actions here, so let's just, uh, get out of here. Oh, okay, we got a little, uh, we got a base camp here set up. Alright, what's up, my guys? Uh, okay, oh. Uh, what is this? Styxia Village, okay. So we have found the Styxia Village. Oh, we got an achievement, too. Oh, we can actually climb up here. Let's, uh, let's climb up here, guys. Let's, uh, let's check out the view. Oh, we got a little bell action. Alright. Oh, this is nice. All right, well, let's just climb back down. Not much to see here. All right, well, let's talk to V on for- Oh, wow, this guy looks so cool. Look, he's like glowing like a Christmas tree. It's pretty cool. Oh, oh, that- Oh, okay, all right, let's talk to- Go talk to V on here. Oh, hello, dear knight. I am V on. I, too, am a knight. I am currently stationed here to carry out His Majesty's orders to wipe out the heretics at Black Rose Chapel. I grew up in this village, you know. I never thought it, I'd come back here for something as terrible as this. I'll change this village with my own hands, without fail. Those cursed heretics. I'll be sure to drive them out of the village. Could you please ring the bell on the steeple so that they can hear it too? Oh, okay. You we were just there. I could definitely do that for you, my guy. I mean, I don't know why you can't freaking do it. But I'll go ahead and do it. Oh, it's Zinnervale. Uh, let's go ahead and ring the bell, skis. Oh, okay. Got a little cutscene. Love me some cutscenes. Oh, it's the heretics. Uh oh. Oh yeah, we're definitely we're definitely gonna freaking freaking poop on these guys when we do the dungeon. I'm I'm I have a freaking uh, grudge against these guys. These guys are freaking a holes. What the hell are they doing, bruh? How are we able to see that anyways? Freaking video game logic. Alright, let's get- let's, uh, climb down. Uh, okay, I'm sure those bastards heard the bell too. That bell was originally designed for anyone to ring if there was something to celebrate. My mother said that the last time it was rung was when King Tyrion was born. This, my homeland, used to be beautiful. Even if it doesn't look it now, even if it doesn't look it now, I thought I was gonna talk some more. Oh, we leveled up, boys! We're level 35! Let's go! Nice, guys. We're level 35, boys. 
Let's freaking go. Let's freaking go. Oh my god, and we can get a, a, t a skill point in our sign of apocalypse. But it's gonna require all 12 of our skill points, but it's fine. It's worth it. Ooh! We get a tier 3 talent upgrade, so let's check out this tier 3 talent upgrade, guys. Oh, what the heck? Level expansion available upon reaching combat level 55. I thought the max level was 50. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe the max level isn't 50. Uh, okay, let's see what um our the new talent that we get is. Okay. Combo number increased to 3. The last at attack's damage is 100% of the second attack's value. Okay. And that is Aftermath of Calamity. Let's check Approach to Apocalypse. Damage to push immune foes plus 80%. So this is probably really good against bosses because bosses don't... Um, get knocked up in the air or they can't get pushed so it's probably good um, but this gives me a third shot for my sign of apocalypse which only has two if you don't uh, if you don't put the point in here and it does basically the same amount of damage as the second attack I'm just gonna take it fuck it I don't even know what's the better one oh we got a uh, we got an achievement let's check out our third shot Oh, nice. Nice. Okay, that's pretty cool. So normally it only does two shots if you guys uh, didn't know. But now Better we get three. Days will come. Oh, it's Armin Hello. here. Nice, Armin. Nice to see you again. Hello. Nice to see you again. Oh, let's talk to Saria here. I was looking around because I was worried about oh, the people gosh, left in the Oh my gosh, she is beautiful. Village. We should have come a little sooner. This place has a long history of being targeted by the heretics. However, the village has never been this deserted. I wonder if everyone's okay. We should hurry on to the Black Rose Chapel. Okay. I'm down, bro. I'm down to fuck these guys up. These guys are assholes, bro. Are you kidding me? Alright, let's go talk to Arm and Hammer. The Black Rose Chapel isn't far from the village. Nice. Let's. I'm freaking ready. I'm ready, dude. I'm ready to freaking fuck these guys up. From what the villagers told me, the number of heretics, uh, heretic believers began to increase at some point, and across the church became, and access to the church became more restricted. We should find a way to get into the church. Facts. All right, so we have to speak with the Stixia Village Chieftain Maya. You scratch my back, I'll scratch yours, right? Um, yeah, unless it's like freaking hairy or something, then maybe I'm not gonna scratch it. All right, let's go talk to Maya. Oh, there are so many soldiers to help our village. I'm very grateful. We have suffered at the hands of the heretics, but no matter how much we begged, Sherrod would never send us help. The heretics aren't as active as they once were since King Tyrion took the throne, but they've begun to engage in more clandestine operations with their headquarters in Black Roach Chapel. If you want to investigate the church, you'd best try to meet the people who have connections there. Oh, come to think of it, there is a moonshiner who supplies the heretics with their ritual wine. Why don't you pay him a visit? The only thing that kept- uh, and she gives us another quest. The only thing that kept us going was the longing for those who were taken from the village. Now I'd like to turn this village into a warm home for the survivors. I'm not sure where to start though. Perhaps we could start by getting rid of those ghastly spiderwebs. Could you give me a hand with that? Freaking A, I guess. Alright, it's an old lady. I guess we're gonna do that. Alright, who is this? Oh, it's the moon. Do you moonshine wanna go to the chapel? Why go to such an ominous place? Because we're gonna frick those guys up, man. Are you looking for a cause for everyone going crazy? Hmm, I'm not sure you'll find anything helpful there, but if you give us a hand, you could gain access. To do that, you'll have to move the wine pots we hid secretly. Do you think you could do that? Uh, I guess... Secretly move the wine thing? What does that even mean? Oh, let's find some of these spiderweb guys. Where are these little cobwebby boys? Uh, help remove these guys. Oh, here we go. Oh, no, this isn't a cobweb. This is a thingy. All right, let's just freaking move some of this wine over here. He Says to do it secretly, but we just passed the guard and he didn't really care, so... Guess it's all good here. Bam! 
Uh, where are the cobwebs though? Oh, maybe other people already uh, taken the cobwebs. Oh, here's a cobweb. Hey, yeah. All right, here's another one. Nice. All right, so let's talk to the moonshiner guy yeah, again. Yeah, looks pretty handy. I jumped through hoops to get this because they needed it for some kind of ritual at their church in a big hurry. Now take this and go see my friend Brian. He'll let you in. All right, Brian. I right, talked to Maya though. Thank you. When the village looks brighter and more welcoming, please drop by again. Be sure to come by when the roses are in full bloom. As you may have seen already, spiders are one of the reasons why Styxia Village looks so gloomy. Perhaps getting rid of some of the spider eggs around here will help thin them out. Alright. Alrighty. I can do that. I can do that. I can definitely do that. Is there a different channel we can go to? Wait, I just changed channel to channel 2 and then all of a sudden I'm in channel 1 again? That makes no sense. Alright, let's go ahead and break some of these egg guys. Oh, nice. Okay. Uh, I guess we'll forage this plant here because I think we have to take some of the, uh, forage some plants for a quest. So we'll just go ahead and do that. Okay. Let's find some more eggies. Oh, we got some more eggies. Well, bam! Oh, they summoned spiders. Okay. Alright, uh, looks like, uh, we found all the eggs. Alright, that's pretty good, pretty good. Oh, we destroyed all the eggs. Alright, so now we have to go deliver the wine to Brian, or to the church entrance, or Daniel. And we got a quest from, uh, Odia. Go ahead and collect, uh, do that quest, too. What are you doing? Why would you kill spiders? Spiders are helpful creatures. Sure, some of them are more slightly da so, sure some of them are slightly more dangerous, but if you know how to handle them, they're perfectly harmless. Yeah, you know, I like the way this guy thinks, you know. Yeah, we shouldn't be going on and freaking killing all the nature around us, right? All right, guys. Uh, it's all part of life, you know. You don't want to uh, mess with the circle of life. You feel me? All right, let's go ahead and talk to Odia. With the kids working so hard for the village, I can't just sit around and do nothing, you know. I came out here because I wanted to help in any way I could, but it turns out that there's not much for me to do. I'm sure these kids out here must miss a hot home-cooked meal, right? If we steam some mandrakes, I'm sure they'll be happy to eat it, don't you think? Yeah, I think so. Food is a great way to show someone that you love them. And that is facts. Alright, so let's fight some mandrakes. Oh my god, they're shooting a little thing of a bob at us. Uh, let's use our new ability. Nice, or a new talent point, I mean. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Bam! Alright, that, was, that wasn't so bad. That was pretty good. Alright, let's go talk to Odie again. Wonderful! I'll fix up a real tasty dish. Just you wait and see. Ta-da! It's ready! Please share this with the kids in the militia. Oh, I've had plenty already. I tasted it while I was cooking. Moms are like that, you know. Oh yes, oh yes, oh dear. All right. Um. Oh, we get a little chest action here. What is this? Oh, potions. Okay. All right. So we gotta deliver the uh, food to the militia man. I've been craving a hot meal so much. Nice. Thank you. It smells wonderful. Ack. I was just getting hungry. Perfect. <laughs> Excuse me. All right. Let's go talk to Ennis. Oh, she's looking kind of badass right now. A little warrior lady. Mom made it? Uh, huh. Why do I feel so nauseous? It must be something I ate earlier. Well, can't let mom's efforts go to waste, sir knight. I'll let you eat it. Uh-oh, this better not be a, like a Naria thing where we freaking like pass out from eating it. This smells is seriously bad. Uh-oh. Oh my god. Yep. We definitely got owned from that food. In my 17 years of life, wow, she's only 17, I was almost killed by mom's cooking several times, so I sort of instinctively reacted like that. But I know it's definitely great for your health. Please don't take it the wrong way. You'll, you're sure feel quite energetic for some time now. You'll need the energy to round up those heretics and save the villagers, I'm sure. Yep. 
Oh, okay, that was it. Alright, alright, that's cool. Alright, so we can, uh... We can go deliver the ritual wine to the church entrance now. It's gonna be pretty cool. Right, guys? Oh, okay, here we go. Oh, wow, these guys Hold. are creepy. Hello, friends. I hope your day is going well. Got today's delivery of ceremonial wine here. We're performing a ritual. No one enters. Really? Hmm, that's a problem. Okay. Oh, here's Brian. All right, let's go talk to Brian here. He said he needed alcohol. What, what's wrong with him now? <laughs> I'm so sorry about this. I guess something important came up. They won't let in any outsiders at all. I guess you can't go in the front entrance. What other way could there be? Oh. You should go to Charon, the great Charon, the gravekeeper. The that old man knows this area better than anyone else, so I'm sure he'll be able to help uh be of some help. He's uh, he's a got he's a got quite a that's a that's a typo. He's a got quite a personality though. Uh, so he might demand something in return. Hmm. All right, all right, all right. Well, let's see what happens when we uh walk here. Get back! You cannot enter this place. Okay, they don't really do anything. All right, it's fine. Why are these guys not hostile? I thought these guys were bad guys. I want to freaking whoop their booty cheeks, bro. All right, let's go talk to Gravekeeper Charon or Charon or freaking whatever the freaking freaking power you freaking pronounce his name. You want to sneak into the chapel? Well, I do know a way in. Oh, do you now? I've been a gravekeeper here for half a century. I don't think there's anyone who knows more about Black Rose Chapel than I do. So how do you get in there? Well, you see, oh my back. Why does my back hurt so much these days? Every joint in my body is so achy. Say, I hear the pollen of bone jasmine just wonders for back pain. I hear they bloom on corpses. If you could bring me some, I just might be able to tell you how to get in there. Now he gives us another quest. Hehe. <laughs> After half a century as a gravekeeper, I can tell when a person will die just by looking at their face. Oh my god. Creepy. Looks like you'll go through thousands of near-death experiences. It's not a bad thing. It means you're very hard to kill. And worse fate can be found in those pathetic idiots who don't even realize they're dead. There aren't just corpses in that graveyard, you see. There are some confused gravekeeper ghosts who still work there, but it's their own graves they tend. Would you help them find peace? Uh, I guess. I guess. I guess. I, 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 I guess. Oh, let's take a look around here, because we have a little area, uh, down here we could check out. Maybe there's another quest here. Oh, what the fuck? Heretic Devotee. Okay. So it looks like there's some bad guys. Ooh, there's a little mini boss here. Heretic Devotee. Looks like it's a mini boss guy. Okay, yeah, let's freaking get down with this guy. Oh, bam! Ooh. Oh, we got stunned though. Oh, nice. We killed him. We killed him pretty easy. That's pretty cool. And we got ourselves a necklace. Oh, it, it's not better than what we have on. But we got some new pants that are better. So let's just go ahead and equip these pants. Oh, we got a card too. I forgot about that. Let's equip the card. Book of Demons. Oh, yeah. The Book of Demons. Oh, we have to learn the uh, laugh emote. I forgot about that. Alright, oh, nice. We got a new emote. It's pretty cool. Alright, is there anything else down here? Maybe, potentially. Let's see what's over here. Uh, oh, we got a lot. Oh! Oh, what is this? Defeat the heretics. Wait, what? what her Wait, what? Where am I? Whoa! What is this place? Oh, this is probably how you sneak in to uh, get into the chapel. Okay. Uh, well, hold on. Let me just ignore this place for now because we got one of those time quests. Oh, and I see a Mokoko seed. We got a time quest, so let's just go ahead and do that. So let's just go there. We have to go all the way over here towards the east side. We gotta kill us some heretics. This is more my at. This is more my pace, guys. All right. I love killing some bad guys. 
Bam! Suck it, man. Hey, yeah. Nice. All right, we got some more. Nice. Oh, our bunny rabbit. There's like a. There was like a uh, like a little rainbow above his head. I don't know what that means. Uh, okay, let's just go ahead and do this quest. I mean, we found that little secret area, but we we could probably we could just go back to it later. Let's just do the quest first. Oh, what is this? Oh, this is the bone jasmine. Okay, oh wow, we only needed one. Okay, and then now we have to defeat Gravekeeper Ghosts. Alright, so we just need to find some ghosty boys. Oh, here we go. I'm the real Gravekeeper. Alright, nice. Just go ahead and just, you know, uh, run up to these guys and freaking just use our abilities on them. Alright, that wasn't so bad. That was pretty easy. That was pretty easy. Let's go ahead and turn in the quest. Let's go talk to Charon. Charon. Stupid old fools. I hope they found their way to the afterlife. Oh, thank okay. you. I didn't mean for you to actually bring it to me. What do you mean? You just asked me to bring you some. But since you've been so kind, I'll make good use of it. See that big tree in the western corner over there? There's a small gap to it. The church is so old that there are cracks here and there, and I happened to find that gap. Seeing as how it's still there, I guess the heretics don't know about it either. Alright, ooh, we got a little questy guy. A little ding action from who is this guy? Acheron. Hello, I'm Acheron, the captain of the Styxia Militia. I heard that you'll be infiltrating the chapel. We have one of our members in there already, too. I'm worried that she might do something crazy since she's an unhealth she has an unhealthy lack of fear. If you see her, please warn her to stick to her surveillance mission and not to try anything stupid. Oh, if you speak to her, she'll probably pretend to be a heretic. My code name is Kaku. So if you ask her if she's heard the Kaku cry, she'll catch on. Alright. I am down. Let's do it. Okay, we gotta go over here. Oh, well, maybe this... Maybe that part wasn't part of it. You know what? Hold on. Let's check out the little secret area first. Um, let's see where it leads. Because <clears throat> I was assuming that this was the secret area that um, Caravan was talking about. But I guess it's not. Because I'm looking at my map and it looks like it's up there. So let's just check this, uh, check this area out first. Alright, so we have a little uh, fork in the road. Let's just go- Oh, well, cocoa seed. Nice. Alright, so let's uh, check here. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, it does lead to the- ch Oh, wait, no, it doesn't. Maybe it does. I don't know. Is there a Mokoko C here? Uh, I don't think so. Uh, Alright, let's go Let's go down. Let's see what's down over here. Oh, we got another Mokoko C. Very nice. Okay, so this is just like a little area with a bunch of Mokoko seeds. Okay, and it looks like that's about it. Alright, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Alright, so we found a little secret area. That's nice. Alright, we, we can go back and do the uh, the main quest. Let's go do that, guys. So what we have to do? We have to use the secret entrance to infiltrate the chapel, and we have to speak to the disguised militia member, Via. Alright, let's do it. Oh, ran into a tree there. Alright, so the secret entrance should be right over here. Yes, sir. All right, there we go, guys. We're here inside the Black Rose Chapel. Let's go ahead and fight us some heretics, huh? I'm down. Oh, who is this? Heretic disguised Armin. Oh, it's Armin. Shh, it's me. <laughs> Looks like there's going to be a big ritual tonight. We should infiltrate it to find out exactly what it is that the heretics are up to. Hello, B. You're going to need an appropriate disguise for the ritual. The ritual is at nightfall, so hurry. Ooh, yay, we get to do a little more disguise action. 
Check the heretic's elder's portrait. Okay, right, let's talk to Via. What is it, brethren? Do you know Acheron? Uh, can you hear the cuckoo cry? Huh? Did Captain Acheron send you? Shh, we mustn't let the other heretics find out. Please, keep your voice down. Alright, it's down, it's down. Fortunately, I guess there's nobody around that might catch us. I've infiltrated this place on a surveillance mission. Those bastards must be plotting something, planning to offer the abducted villagers as sacrifice for their rituals. The villagers have been locked away somewhere in the church. Although I'm only allowed to sit back and watch on my mission, I can barely hold back my rage when I think of all the evil they've caused. Nothing would satisfy me more than to exterminate all of them. Oh, come to think of it, I may not be allowed to do anything on my surveillance mission, but you're not bound by any such restrictions, are you, Night Hello B? Right? <laughs> oh, I definitely am not. Let's freaking get- I'm freaking ready to freaking own some heretics, alright? Alright, okay guys. I think this will be a good time to end the video, though. So we're going to... Let me get a nice little angle here. Alright, guys. So that, guys, is going to be the end of the video. Once again, thank you guys all for watching, stopping by, liking the video, commenting, all that good stuff. Appreciate all you guys. And yeah, guys, it's going to be pretty exciting. Next video, The next video is going to be pretty exciting. We're going to infiltrate the, um, what is this called? The Black Rose Chapel. And we're going to do us some uh, heretic slaying. Pretty excited, pretty excited. Because these guys are freaking douchebags, alright? We got to yeah, I just want to freaking own them all, you know? But um, yeah guys, I think that's going to be it. I'm going to try to upload this video today, but I kind of uploaded uh, the video that I was supposed to upload today a little bit later. So I might upload this one tomorrow, I don't know. I'm going to keep trying to stick to doing the double uploads. It's a little bit hard though for me, so honestly I, I might go back to the single uploads a day. I'm going to just I'm gonna keep trying though to do two uploads, but if I can't then I just want you guys to know I'm sorry. Um, but yeah guys, I think that's going to be it for me today. Once again, thank you guys all for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video. See you guys later. Peace.